Good morning everybody. Um, I've just come to you today to talk about ribbons. Uh, these are just a few of the ones we've got in here but I just wanted to show you uh, different colours, different ways of putting things together, actually showing you then how to put them in a tree. Um, what I like to do is work out whether I want a feature ribbon, um, whether I want a pair of ribbons to complement a colour theme in a tree and um, sometimes even have a feature ribbon and maybe two complementary ribbons to even jazz it up a bit more. It really just depends on what your colour theme is and what you look you're going for. Um, I generally like using two ribbons in the tree. So I've got this uh, lovely lime green with the red glitter snowflake and I'm teaming it up with the four inch red mesh uh, this looks superb in a tree, which I'll show you soon. Um, it just really, I don't know, it just takes the place. I think ribbons actually take the place of uh, tinsel. Tinsel's a bit of a no-no word in here. I'm not a big fan of it, but um, you know, when you've got little kids, yes, it's lots of fun. But I think ribbons and foliage and flowers have really taken the place of tinsel. Um, and I will show you how I put it in the tree soon. But I just wanted to show you that you can use, you know, different widths are great to complement each other in trees as well. So this is a two inch, that's a four inch, that works well together. Um, one of my favorite combinations, excuse me, is I adore this Nutcracker ribbon. And this Nutcracker ribbon is a double ribbon. It's got the red velour with the Nutcrackers, and then on the back, it's a gold. So as that flows through your tree, you can really get a play with the gold as well. But uh, when I put this one in the harlequin tree I did in the shop, I loved teaming it with this black velour, which if you can see in the video, has a bit of a texture pattern through it. And I actually put the nutcracker in as a feature ribbon. So I sway that through the tree, which I'll show you how I do that. But then I used this black with the red mesh as ribbons together. So it really complements that Nutcracker Harlequin look that people are sort of really in for this uh, season. So I'll just show you those two. This is a lovely two inch wide, um, like a burlap look with the white print of the deer face in the wreath and Merry Christmas um, for a really nice country look you can get two very different looks by teaming this either with a farmhouse black and white check then if you want to go a bit deeper it looks great with the red and black farmhouse check this is one of my favorites can you tell i love the red and black farmhouse buffalo check so that's another good combination this ribbon here it's a great red glitter stripe with the white, with the fluffy sort of snow look on the edge. I love teaming it for a red and white look in a tree. It can either be in a snow flock tree or in a green tree. But this ribbon here with the glitter, let it snow with the white snowflake on the burlap, really teams up well in the tree with this one. We've got the netting in the green as well that looks awesome through the tree it can be teamed up with something as simple uh, something as simple as this one these two look awesome together um, with the wire edge um, I love how the green really picks up against the jute sort of mesh with the glitter so these are a great combination of a two inch and four inch together. Okay, so here's a few more of our ribbons in stock at the moment. Um, show you a couple of other little plays on colors. Now this is a um, really sweet burlap with the sort of vintage gold glitter on the edge. Um, I like this one actually on its own, but you can match it up with so many different colorways. For a country look, you can go for this red and green with the gold edge 
uh, check. If you're into autumn colours, I've got this gorgeous orange glitter which just sparkles beautifully. I've teamed this one up before with turquoise as well, but it does look awesome with the maple leaf. So that's something nice for now, because we're in the middle of our beautiful autumn. Now who doesn't love a cardinal? We've got quite a few cardinal lovers that come into the shop and we always have lots of cardinals. So this is our four inch cardinal ribbon. Um, I've teamed it up before with the red snowflake and a two inch wide one as well. But you're really only limited by your own imagination and like I've said before, it just depends on what colour thing you're going for in your tree. Um, what's really been popular is a lot of the silvers, golds and rose gold. So this is a gorgeous gold and cream. Very hard to show you this one because it's so reflective but it looks stunning in a tree. Um, I've teamed this one up before again with the burlap with the gold just for something a little bit different. Probably one of our biggest themes from last year is definitely the rose gold. So we've got quite a few different real beautiful um, shimmery pink mesh style plus this one. These work well together if you want major pizzazz when it comes to pink. This has got a bit more gold in it so it's really good if you're doing the um, rose gold, copper plus gold or champagne even in a snowflop tree. I prefer these colours in a snowflop tree personally. Um, then we've got gingerbread man ribbon is like a double ribbon so it's one sewn on the other so you've got a nice sort of brown on one side the gingerbread colour with the little gingerbread men flowing through. I love this one as a feature ribbon. But if you really want to go for a lolly tree nothing looks cuter than teaming it with this um, red and white candy stripe with the snow fluffy edge. Um, I've got a tree in here at the moment that has both of these ribbons in it so I'll show you those as well. Um, or you can even team it up. Oops, there it goes. You can even team it up with the red mesh because these look really good in the tree together. Now I showed you this Merry Christmas ribbon before, but I've brought it over here as well because I've got a few colours here that it works well with as well. So um, this is like a Shantung organza with a red snowflake. And it teams really well with this Merry Christmas ribbon. And you're probably wondering how much all these ribbons are. Well, most of them start at around $24.95 for some of the two inch wide ribbons. They're all 9.14 metres long, which is 10 yards. Um, and then work their way through to some of the four inch uh, feature ribbons like the Nutcracker ribbons. They're around $80 to $90 a roll. Um, this is a really sweet Santa Claus ribbon. Again, I would call this a Great feature ribbon because it's a four inch wide ribbon. But it can team up nicely with your snowflake ribbon. It can team up with the harlequin ribbon. It can even team up nicely with the mesh. So these are just a few of the um, ribbons we've got in stock at the moment. We've got a lot more coming in in other colours as well. But I just wanted to start doing these videos in our downtime just to show you what we've got in stock. Um, now I'm going to pull a few of these off the stand. These are our Catherine's Collection ribbons. Now these are absolutely stunning. These are a feature ribbon. Most of them are double layer. This one has little dingle bells on it. Uh, 
this one is $100 and it's only 4.5 meters, but it's a very luxurious ribbon. Uh, I don't tend to cut these ones because it just feels criminal to do it. Um, so the Catherine's ones I tend to use as feature ribbons, which I'll swag through the tree and then complement them with other ribbons that we've got. Like this one is just superb. It's a rich, beautiful olive green. Looks a bit darker in the in the uh, camera here, but it is all. It's a double layer with the gold lace, and then it has jewel, jewels all sort of stuck through it. Um, plus, it's a beautiful gold on the back. Uh, this one is four and a half meters long. Again, it makes a superb feature ribbon, and it's one hundred and forty nine ninety five for this one. So. The Catherine's ones aren't cheap, but they make a fantastic impact on your tree. This is another fun one. I love this one with all the little rhinestones all over it and the silver snowflakes. It's a silver on the back. Uh, so this is a, uh, this one's 4.5 yards, which is about four meters, four and a half meters. It's 59.95. But you can always jazz it up with one of the cheaper ribbons. Like this one here is $29.95. And really, you can play with that one in amongst your tree as well. I'll show you a couple of last um, Catherine's ribbons before I start putting it into a tree. I'll show you what to do. But this is a gorgeous uh, Velour double ribbon with the red and black check. Now, you could have some fun with this one as in a harlequin look or with the nutcracker ribbon um, or you can downplay it and use it as a country ribbon and team it with something simple as the red mesh but again it's only four and a half meters actually no this one's longer sorry this one's nine meters so it's a bit better value of this Catherine's one at $69.95, probably because there's not so much bling on it. This one's only four and a half meters, but very beautiful. It's got the Merry Christmas and the red on the back. Um, again, I would swag this one whole through the tree, maybe team it up with something simple like the harlequin you can use that a bit more through the tree and really highlight this one uh, this merry christmas one is 69.95 so thanks for watching i'm learning a little bit of our ribbon display here um, like i said to you they're priced from around 24.95 right through to some of the Catherine's ones at 150 dollars but they are very elaborate feature ribbons um, I'm going to be post putting all these ribbons online so you can purchase them. Our next video will be showing you how to put the ribbons in the tree. I'll be cutting some, just showing you how to swag it through. From using them in the topper to swagging them through using a feature ribbon, using different widths of ribbon and yeah, just giving you the confidence to have a go at cutting them and placing them in there. So thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned.